Have you ever wondered which is better for food or farming, bison, buffalo, or beef? You might be surprised by the key differences that set them apart. Each has its own advantages, from nutrition to farming efficiency to environmental impact. But which one is the right choice for your farm or dinner table? Stick around, and by the end, you'll have a clear answer. Let's start with the basics. What are the key differences between bison, buffalo, and beef cattle? The names are often used interchangeably, but they're entirely different animals. Bison, American and European, are native to North America and parts of Europe. They are instantly recognizable due to their large hump, thick coat, and massive heads. Their muscular build and dense fur allow them to survive in extreme cold, making them ideal for regions with harsh winters. Buffalo, African Cape Buffalo and Asian Water Buffalo, are native to Africa and Asia. Unlike bison, they lack a hump and have a smoother coat. Their long, curved horns and stocky bodies help them thrive in warmer climates, and they are often found near water sources. Beef cattle come from domestic breeds like Angus, Hereford, and Wagyu, which have been selectively bred for meat production. They are smaller than bison and buffalo, but grow faster and have a more consistent meat quality. Why does this matter? Physical traits influence how well these animals adapt to different environments. If you're in a cold climate, bison may be the best choice. In tropical regions, buffalo are better suited. And if you want a well-established, scalable option, beef cattle are the most practical choice. Which animal is easiest to raise, grows the fastest, and provides the best yield? Let's compare. Bison are low-maintenance and mostly grass-fed, meaning they don't require intensive feeding. However, they take longer to mature, often 2.5 to 3 years before reaching market weight. Buffalo are mainly used for dairy production in Asia, but their meat is also consumed. They are adaptable and can survive on rough terrain with minimal care. However, they are less common for meat farming outside of Asia. Beef cattle have the fastest growth rate, reaching market weight in just 18, 24 months. Modern cattle farming techniques focus on maximizing meat yield through controlled diets, grain feeding, and selective breeding. What does this mean for farmers? If you want quick turnaround and high efficiency, beef cattle are the best bet. If you prefer low cost, natural grazing systems, bison might be ideal. And if you're in a buffalo-friendly region, they could be a profitable niche market. Which meat is the best for your health? Let's break it down. Bison meat is leaner, containing less fat and fewer calories than beef. It is packed with protein, iron, omega-3s, and B vitamins, making it an excellent choice for heart health, muscle building, and fat loss. It also has higher CLA, conjugated linoleic acid, which supports metabolism and immunity. Buffalo meat is leaner than beef, but has a similar taste. It is commonly used in traditional Asian dishes and is often a more affordable alternative in some regions. Beef has a higher fat content, especially in grain-fed cattle. However, grass-fed beef contains more omega-3s and antioxidants, making it a healthier option than feedlot beef. Health benefits at a glance. For lean protein and muscle growth, choose bison. For an affordable, lean alternative to beef, Choose buffalo. For a richer taste and higher fat content, choose beef. Which one makes the most money? Bison meat is a premium product, often priced higher than beef, due to its health benefits and niche market appeal. However, raising bison requires specialized handling. Buffalo meat is more popular in regions like India and Southeast Asia, where beef consumption is lower. Outside of these areas, the market is smaller. Beef is the most widely consumed red meat globally, making it the most stable and profitable option for farmers. Key takeaway, if you want to target health-conscious consumers, bison is a lucrative option. If you need a low-cost alternative, 
In certain markets, buffalo could work. But if you want a high-volume, high-demand product, beef is the safest choice. Which one is better for the planet? Bison are natural grazers that restore grasslands and improve soil health. Their free-range lifestyle means fewer greenhouse gas emissions compared to industrial beef farming. Buffalo are low-maintenance animals that thrive on natural forage. They require fewer resources than beef cattle. Beef cattle raised in feedlots contribute significantly to deforestation, water consumption, and methane emissions. However, regenerative beef farming practices are emerging as a more sustainable alternative. Sustainability matters. If you want to farm with minimal environmental impact, bison and buffalo are the better choices. Every livestock choice comes with unique difficulties. Before deciding, it's crucial to understand the challenges of raising or consuming bison, buffalo or beef cattle. Bison challenges. Wild nature. Unlike domestic cattle, bison are still considered wild animals. They are stronger, more aggressive and unpredictable, requiring careful handling, special fencing and infrastructure. Standard cattle fences won't work. Bison need heavy-duty steel fencing, which increases costs. Longer growth time, since they mature slower, 2.5 to 3 years versus 18 to 24 months for beef, farmers must wait longer for returns. Limited processing facilities. Bison require specialized slaughtering and processing, as many facilities are not equipped to handle them. Buffalo challenges. Limited commercial farming outside Asia. While buffalo farming is common in India, Pakistan, and Southeast Asia, large-scale meat production is rare in Western countries. Lower demand in Western markets. Unlike beef, buffalo meat has less recognition and consumer demand in places like the US and Europe. Not as well researched, buffalo farming lacks the advanced breeding, health management, and optimized feeding systems that cattle enjoy. Beef cattle challenges. Higher feed costs. Industrial beef farming relies on grain-fed diets, which require large amounts of corn, soy, and water. Disease risks. Cattle are susceptible to diseases like bovine respiratory disease, BRD, foot and mouth disease, and mad cow disease, which can impact profitability. Environmental concerns. Feedlot-based beef production is one of the largest contributors to greenhouse gas emissions, deforestation, and water consumption. Market price fluctuations. Beef prices can be unstable due to demand shifts, feed costs, and global trade policies. The bottom line, if you're looking for low-maintenance animals, bison and buffalo require less intervention than beef cattle. If you need stable market demand, Beef is the safest bet. If you want to stand out in a niche, bison or buffalo could offer high-value opportunities with the right market. Food isn't just about taste. It plays a vital role in your overall health, fitness, and longevity. So, which meat is the healthiest for long-term well-being? Bison, the ultimate superfood, high in lean protein, more protein per serving than beef, with fewer calories and less fat. Rich in iron and B12, helps prevent anemia, boosts energy and supports brain function. Loaded with omega-3s and CLA, aids in heart health, fat loss and muscle building. No hormones or antibiotics. In the US, it's illegal to give bison growth hormones, making it one of the cleanest meats available lower cholesterol and inflammation. Ideal for people at risk of heart disease or high cholesterol. Buffalo, a lean alternative, lower in fat than beef. Comparable to bison, but not as widely available. Rich in minerals, contains zinc, selenium, and phosphorus, which aid in immune support and metabolism. Beef, nutrient dense, but higher in fat. More marbling equals richer taste, Fat contributes to the juiciness and flavor of beef. High in creatine and zinc, supports muscle recovery, brain function, 
and immune health. Grain-fed versus grass-fed matters. Grass-fed beef has higher omega-3s, but grain-fed beef has higher saturated fat, which may impact heart health, possible hormone exposure. Some beef cattle are given growth hormones to speed up production, which raises concerns for long-term health. Healthiest choice? If you want lean, high-protein, nutrient-rich meat, bison is the best choice. If you're looking for a leaner beef alternative, buffalo works well. If you prioritize taste and muscle growth, beef, especially grass-fed, is a great option. But watch out for high fat intake. Now you know the key differences between bison, buffalo, and beef. Whether you prioritize health, profitability, or sustainability, there's a clear winner for your goals. Which one will you choose? Let us know in the comments.